Well, what's in the box, Jack? So there was much fanfare when the Moving Pictures 40 year anniversary box set was announced and there was a lot of ex excitement about that. Moving Pictures is one of the most, if probably the most known record of Rush. And yeah, the most popular, the most sold. And that was a very special time for Rush fans. And those Rush fans did not know how special it was till now. <laughs> well, you know, maybe sometime after that they did too, but especially now, such excitement for this anniversary edition. Yeah, there was some excitement of the previous records for, you know, 2112 up up to uh, Permanent Waves, but uh, Moving Pictures has defi definitely been quite the buzz. So when the box set was announced, I go to check to see, to, you know, to check it out, to see what they had included. And they had vinyl, CDs, Moving Pictures, flats, you know, pictures of the covers and whatnot. And um, it was about 300 bucks. And I said, <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute, that's quite a bit. So, but fortunately, they had other options as well. And as far as me, I'm not a big fan of vinyl. I've never been a big fan of vinyl ever since, even when I was a kid growing up in the 70s, when you know, those vinyl eight track cassette, and there was a lot of vinyl in my house. And of course, I had Rush Records as well growing up. And you know, I liked it because it was Rush and I liked the music, but I never could settle for the snap, crackle, and pop. Of the, of the vinyl sound, that warm sound that people like. To me, it's, it interrupts from the music itself. I know it's an experience. I know that a lot of people like vinyl, but that it's just not for me. When, when I heard the first DVD, I mean the first CD, I think Subdivisions was the first CD I heard. Not sure. I just know that when I heard the first CD, I, never, I don't think I heard vinyl again. I mean, the sound was so amazing. The dynamic range you get from a CD compared to vinyl it just made the decision for me so easy easy from that point forward to um, pursue CD. So anyway, back to today, there was an option for getting uh, the three CD set for the Moving Pictures 40th anniversary, which was um, Moving Pictures, I think remastered, I think, and two live CDs, CD one and two, from a concert from that tour, from the Moving Pictures tour that is not the concert that we know and love today, which is Exit Stage Left Vinyl, and also the Exit Stage Left DVD, which amongst the two, the only common song is Red Barchetta, to my knowledge. Every other song that are the same on each of those, the vinyl and the DVD concert release, um, they're all, they're different nights, except for Red Barchetta, which is the same on both. So now we have another official release of another night on that tour, fantastic. I jumped on that and I ordered that. I know I also ordered the two flats of the Moving Pictures um, cover, the vinyl cover. So we'll see what those look like. So, you know, I received the box with those items and I'm gonna, this is the first time I ever do an unboxing of anything on, on any channel. <laughs> so I'm going to just open it up and see what we got. Okay, so I got my infamous glasses on so I can see what I'm doing close up. And I got this, you know, any old knife. Here's the box right here, all right? Uh, yeah, we gotta look, look at my monitor here to make sure you can see what I see. Um, all right, so I'm just gonna open this up very carefully and go to the other side. Oh, I cut the flat. No. Open that up very carefully. I don't wanna mess up any of the merchandise. Make sure there are no animals over there. They can stab. I might need that knife again, I don't know. Okay, so got this. How's that going? Yeah, that's good. Okay, so we got some fluff here. We can use this for shipping somewhere else. So I am assuming that these are the other CDs. So let me open that up here. And here we go. That's nothing. All right, so we got the Rush Moving Pictures 40. Yeah, let me get put that close up. See if you can see that. Yeah, that's the that's the cover of the three CD set, and that was the front. And this is you see, yeah, this is the back right there. So that's what this is the three CD set. Uh, I'm gonna put that to the side for a moment. Let me put it over here, and let me just pull out what else is in here. Um, ah, okay, I see. Ah, this is nice. <laughs> This is very nice. 
Um, have this very nicely packed. So we got two flats. Is it two separate flats or one on each side? Oh, okay. So this is one, one piece of paper. It looks like it's a 12 by 12. And this is the moving pictures flat, right, from the record itself. That's one side. And then the other side is this Rush Moving Pictures 40. And it says 1981. And it shows uh, different people, blurred people, moving with uh, pictures. And uh, let me see, we get right in the middle, right there. I think that's pretty cool. I don't know what I'm going to do with this. I'm probably going to cover it somehow and hang it up. But if I hang it up, only one side will show at a time. So, But this is the more common one that we've grown to know and love. This side may be something that's worth displaying, right? So that's pretty cool. I'm going to put that, keep that there. And I'm going to keep it nice and covered. Now, as far as the CDs, I'm going to open this up and see what we got here. I still want to be kind of careful opening this up. Yeah, so I want to... I think I want to conserve the sticker that's on the plastic. Uh, let me read you what it says. It says 40th Anniversary 3 CD Deluxe Edition 2015 Album Remaster on CD for first time. Okay, there we go. So then we also have the Live in YYZ 1981. 19 unreleased live performances. The complete concert. It's also a 24-page booklet designed by Hugh Syme with unreleased illustrations, photos, and liner notes by Kim Thayo, Les Claypool, Taylor Hawkins, the late Taylor Hawkins, uh, Bill Kelleher, and Neil Sanderson. That sounds really interesting. So I wanna, I'm going to keep that little sticker there. Then if we open this up, uh, we've got some nice cool pictures of the boys. Let me uh, put that close there. Oh, here we got. Right there. I want to make sure you can see it really well. There's a... Um, the three and we got the three performing as well so that's really fantastic oh you can if we open it up we have even more oh let me open it up even more still so this is really nice this opens up let me make sure um you can see the whole thing so these are the pictures that are included of the three guys in the uh, moving pictures record and in the CD, I believe, the three of them, right? You know, I think there's some light shining on there. There we go. That's that's a little better. And then the other one is, a, I guess, a ticket from the show that is one of is the two live CDs that's included there. Very, very nice. So that's a very nice picture. Nice pictures there. I want to be very careful with what I do here. So there are the three CDs in there. I'm going to be careful. Okay, there's one there. And I think they said there's a booklet in here, which there is. I'm not going to go through the whole booklet because, you know, you might not want to buy it. <laughs> no, you will. So here's the booklet. Rush Moving Pictures, 40th Anniversary. That's the cover of the, of the booklet right there. Really nice. And on the back, I think there's something here a little poignant. So we got the number two covering the number three. And I believe that's a reference to Neil not being with us anymore. Um, you know, it's a, it's a nice detail. And yes, yeah, so I'm going to go through this. Uh, I guess they said a 24-page booklet of the different fellows that uh, wrote in it. And see what the liner notes are. And there's, there's some nice pictures here of the guys. Um, let me see if there's one that I may show um, just as a teaser. <laughs> so, yeah, so here, I mean, you won't be able to see it very well. Okay, so here on the left are the original, are the, are the original album credits. Let's see, yeah, are the original album credits, and on the right are the moving picture, moving pictures, 40th seat, 40 anniversary, 40 year anniversary credits. So that's a nice little touch there. So yeah, so let me uh, put that back in here. And I got some reading to do. Got some things gonna look up. So let me uh, close that up. <laughs> it's funny. So that that's the 
uh, unboxing of the CD set that I got. I got I decided to get the three CD set, which included the remaster of uh, Moving Pictures from 2015, first time on CD. I, I didn't remember that little detail, but uh, I'm going to look that up and take a listen, uh, an audio file listen to see if I catch the differences from the original. And then also the two CDs from that uh, concert, uh, a new date, and with all those unreleased live performances. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually review the live show. And I'm going to compare it to what we already know uh, from uh, Exit Stage Left vinyl and also Exit Stage Left, the concert DVD, uh, the concert footage, which, like I mentioned, is different from the vinyl except for one song, Red Barchetta, which it's the same on both. So I'm going to do a review of that and let you know what I think of it. And that should be a lot of fun. So, yeah, thank you for joining me on this unboxing. And we'll see you in the next video.